Well, good morning. It is 60 degrees and feeling like a nice break from the summer heat. But today we're gonna to be talking about probably what I believe is the best layout blind on the market. Um, one of my favorite layout blinds, the favorite layout blind that I've ever used. So if you guys haven't seen a layout blind before, these are a fantastic tool for a waterfowl hunter, whether you hunt public or private fields or ponds or marshes. They just, they work pretty much everywhere and they give you a really low profile hide and you can stack a bunch of them together. They just work really well. So let's go through the setup of the knockout blind, take a look at it and I'll show you guys why I like it so much. One of the best things about the knockout blind is how fast it's set up and the teardown time is. So all you gotta do is unclip those, unfold the boot bag. <laughs> There's Pop-Tart wrappers coming out of this blind. I haven't cleaned this out since season, so uh, there could be some hidden treasures in here. But then all you gotta do is on the back side there's like a little field goal post and sometimes you gotta press down on the back bar a little bit and you just snap it into place boom and then same thing on the sides there's a little post just flip that up and then you just snap it into place it is one of the fastest setup times I've ever seen in a layout blind. Super sturdy. See, I'm about 200 pounds and I'm literally standing on top of this thing. Like you can't break this. So if you're a bigger dude, you struggle getting in and out, you really gotta push down on the bars, this is a great blind for you. It's just super sturdy. It works really well and I love it. There's plenty of room in here. On the inside, it does come with a little Velcro on pouch, so, you know, trash, shells, snacks, whatever. Um, there's just a ton of room for activities in here. On the back side, you've got this mesh little cover that'll cover the back of your head. Got a nice handle on the back side to drag it around. Backpack straps on the back. Velcro locking face mesh which is kind of nice. I like to poke my head out. I know some people yell at me for that, but I got to see and the GoPro's got to see. So it's kind of nice to have that Velcro to snap that away. Flag locker. If you want to keep a goose flag in there, you can. And uh, let's see, one more thing. Well, two more things. There's flag ports on each side. So if you are uh, wanting to flag out of the blind, you can do it on either side. And then on the end here is a zippered clean out. Pretty solid. One more thing I want to touch on is uh, I do have this covered in a uh, raffia grass. This is the final approach whoop grass. So if you guys are looking to brush in your blind, go ahead and pick up the blind, pick up the whoop grass. It'll come one package and you just put it all together and you're good to go. Uh, I love the raffia grass on my layout blinds. It just makes it easy to set up on ponds and marshes and things of that nature. Um, I don't really have a hard time hiding this in a field usually with the raffia grass because put a lot of corn or I'm hiding in grass. So uh, it just blends in really well. But stubble straps, there's a lot of them. They're really good. But a quick tip for you guys is if you are looking to have an easier time to brush your blind in or uh, set it up before season to kind of hide anywhere you want to go and then you just kind of fill in the, the gaps when you get there, raffia grass is a great tool. So you can see I've got natural grass brushed in on it, but also I've got that base layer of this raffia and it just, it looks really good. And I think it, it helps uh, with losing grass and uh, just being able to quickly brush in when you get to your spot. So let me know down in the comments what you guys think of this knockout blind. If you've used one, great. Let me know your opinions on it. But I mean, I've absolutely loved it. And Final Approach was the first company to come out with a layout blind. Go figure, they've still got the best one on the market. So if you guys want to support me and what I do over here, there's a link down below to the knockout blind. Chop through that link, it'll let, you, let them know that I sent you over to their website and uh, pick one of these up for the season because they are the bee's knees. They're not super heavy, packed down really easily, set up really easily. They're just a fantastic little layout blind. And I gotta say, if you are a bigger dude or girl, if, you, if you're just a large individual, it's a great blind for you too, because there's a lot of room in it. So if you're somebody that 
either brings a lot of gear, you like to nest inside your layout blind, or you're just a bigger dude and you take up a lot more space than some of the skinny guys. There's a lot of room in there for you. That's it for today. I hope you guys enjoyed it. And uh, make sure to subscribe to the channel if you haven't already to stay tuned for more hunting content coming your way. I'll catch you guys on the next one.